All right, I'm here with Roger Hayden in his second to last Superbike race. P4 today, right? How did you feel about that? Yeah, I felt pretty good. Uh, I was a little disappointing to be third, and then uh, somebody knocked me off the track, you know, headed to the white flag, so that was a little little aggressive. But, no, it was cool to be battling for the podium and, you know, my last weekend racing. So uh, got a lot of people from home here. I'm only like four and a half hours from here, so a bunch of guys I graduated high school with and a bunch of friends at home are all here so um yeah it was cool if you feel like there's extra motivation now to finish this uh, career this illustrious career off well no not really I, I did it first but i've always had so much pressure on me my whole uh my whole career i'm actually trying to enjoy it but i tell myself that and then as soon as the green flag or the red light goes off then that just goes out the window and i just want to have a good result but you know, it's a weird feeling knowing that this is going to be the last day. But on one hand, when I thought about retiring, I, I thought about all that. And uh, I'm just ready. So there's 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 other stuff in life, too. So you, you keep keep stuff going. And and I mean, we're I, I didn't want to get into this right now, but it's it's definitely going to be very interesting to not have a Hayden here in the paddock. Yeah, that, a lot of people say that. And, uh, you know, I hope. My plan is to try to stay involved in road racing. Uh, I still love the sport. I still love coming to the races. I just can't do what I used to do on the bike. And, you know, I think not every professional athlete comes to that point in their career. And uh, sometimes it's tough to admit, but so uh, whether or not it's with Suzuki, which what I'd like to do, but if that don't work out, helping young riders, but I always want to keep coming to the races. And I want to promote the sport, help it grow, and keep the Hayden name uh, out there. I mean, it's this is weird to say, but it's kind of a big name in, in the racing. Not to sound, I don't know, it sounds kind of arrogant to say, but. but it, we, we don't, we don't, everyone, everyone that's watching this agrees exactly that. It's not arrogant. But it's the truth. So I want to keep it out there and keep it pushing. And I want to see, I want to see the sport grow back to, uh, where it used to be and so yeah hopefully you still see me around just won't see me on the track all right uh five random questions here uh cake or pie cake hamburger or hot dog oh that's a tough one ham cheeseburger beer or wine not really either but if i had to i'd go beer solid uh blonde or brunette i gotta go with blonde my wife's blonde Good choice. And the last one, which uh, we'll start a bit of controversy here. Canadian bacon or American bacon? American bacon, for sure. But it has to be, it has to be like really well cooked, like black. Not like black as your shirt, but if it's not crispy, you can't have like that chewy, like fatty bacon. You need to like, when you do this, it needs to break. So uh, if it's crispy, there's, there's no comparison. Awesome. All right, Roger. Thanks so much for talking to us. All right. Thanks.